Welcome to Scriptures for Life with TorahFamily.org, taking time to focus on the Father's way. Proverbs 27, 17. As iron sharpens iron, so one man sharpens another. Have you ever sharpened iron with iron before? It's difficult, but it can be done. The preferred way of sharpening for many is using a stone. Yet, iron can indeed sharpen iron. But it must be noted that iron can dull iron just the same. If the angle in which you are holding both pieces of iron are not positioned correctly, or even stone, you could actually do more damage to the blade, in turn making it all the more difficult to make the blade sharp again. These principles need to be kept in mind when a person is wanting to help another. Again, as iron sharpens iron, so one man sharpens another. You may have good intentions on sharpening somebody's dull area of their life, but if it's not done correctly, you could do more harm than good. You have to approach the situation in prayer, and love has to be the driving focus of your motivation. If you are just trying to point out someone's weak spot or how you are better than them in this area, your motivation of pride will be exposed and that friendship will be all but lost. Let this be a focus in your time of meditation throughout the day. Until next time, Shalom.